<laughs> All right. Um, say we're say we're back again. Say we're back. <laughs> <laughs> it's not as funny with them. Infidels. Infidels. All right. Um. So, what is your impression as to how most Israelis? that you've encountered um, understand the term Arab? What comes to their minds? Like, if you ask someone, the average Israeli, what do you think about Arabs? Just that specific term. What are they thinking when they use that term? Yeah, a lot of, a lot of people, you give them that term Arab, they'll think in their head, Muslim terrorist or someone that's gonna come do some, some harm. Okay, so for them, the term Arab, whether it's accurate or not, in, in, in their understanding that's of... For, that's from my experience. All right, so in their understanding of the word, in, in your experience, uh, most Israelis you've encountered understand the term Arab more in, in a sense of an ideological, religious type term. Like, know, connected like to fanaticism. Yeah, it was connected, yeah, connected to fanaticism. Like, oh, look, okay. there's an Arab, meaning, oh, there's like, you know, there's some potential threat. All right. So that, uh, that doesn't necessarily mean that Means, so it means a lot of times they'll say Arab, that means the majority of times in this country it's someone who's Muslim. Okay. They're not going to say, hey, look, not that Jew from Iraq. All right. You know? And do they make any distinctions uh, among different kinds of uh, non-Jewish locals? Like, we have Bedouins here and Dwoos here, Christians. Yeah, sometimes they'll say, you know, they're Jews or they're, or they're Bedouin, but usually it's a general term when they say Arab. All right. They say for everyone. And do, do you... Do they perceive um, and this is, in a sense, all the times it depends where you are, where you mm -hmm. go. But left is a negative connotation. Mm -hmm. like it's, hey, be careful. Well, there's there's well, an Arab. What would you say is the perception of Druze or Bedouins here? Is that different? The or? Druze, the Druze are a little better. If you want to look at what do you like, mean by better? Like, like, like his an, perception of them? Like or? A, yeah, a better, nicer perception. Like, oh, okay. the Druze are okay. Whatever. Bedouins. Um, a lot of times. They're, they're, I guess if you want to look at a three-step thing, Arab, meaning a Muslim people uh -huh. are worse, then you have Bedouins, mm -hmm. and then you have Druze. The Bedouins a lot of times are, are looked down upon because they do a lot of theft. The majority of the car theft in this country is by a lot of Bedouins, you okay. say. So but less so terrorism, you would say. Less, yeah, less more like terrorism. If you look as well, like in the recent history, only in the past year, maybe like one or two terrorists were Bedouin okay. descent. The majority of the crime that's happened in the country is from a Bedouin of, of even like stealing from the army. Um, more petty type you know, crime. Yeah, petty Less type stealing violent. cars and things like mm -hmm. that, but more criminal things than terrorism. Okay. So um, there seems to sort of exist like a distinction that's made, again, whether it's technically accurate or not, Correct. between the, the use of the term Arab and then the use of the term like Bedouin and Dwuz. They Correct. kind of seemed as though like they're distinct entities from this Arab terrorist concept. Right. All right. Interesting. Very cool. Tayyib. Tayyib. Yalla bye. Yalla bye. Yalla bye.